Good day, mga mahal, my fellow cats, beloved. I am here at Marina Bay Sands and the Lotus Garden. <laughs> oh, we praise the Lord and we glorify your Father God. Thank you, Lord, for this wonderful day. Hallelujah. We give glory to you, oh God. Yes, so so good, Lord. You're so awesome. You're so wonderful, Father. And with you, oh God, Lord, nothing is impossible. You can make all things possible, Jesus. And God, thank you that you love us, Lord, with an everlasting love. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, we praise you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. And we commit ourselves into your mighty hands again today, Father. Our spirit, soul, and body, the church, take over, Lord. Ikaw po ang manguna sa lahat, mahal na Panginoon. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord, that thank you, Father, that no weapon that is formed against us shall prosper. And every tongue which rises against us in judgment, we do condemn. This is our heritage as a servant of the Lord, and our righteousness is from you, O Lord of hosts. If there are those that have been speaking or praying against us, or seeking harm or evil to us, have rejected us, Lord, we forgive them. Having forgiven them, we bless them in the name of the Lord. <laughs> now we declare, O oh Lord, that you and you alone are our God, and besides you, Lord, there is no other a just God, the Father, the Son, and the Spirit, and we worship you. We submit ourselves up for second to the Lord in unreserved obedience. Having submitted to you, Lord, we do as your word directs. We resist the devil, all his pressures, his attacks. His deception. Every instrument or agent would seek to use against us, we do not submit. We resist him, drive him from us, and explode him from us in the name of Jesus. Specifically, Lord, we reject and repel infirmity, pain, infection, inflammation, malignancies, allergies, coronavirus, muscular dystrophy, and every form of witchcraft. Finally, Lord, we thank you that through the sacrifice of Jesus on the cross, we have passed out from under the curse and entered into the blessing of Abraham, whom you blessed in all things, yes, exaltation, health, reproductiveness, prosperity, victory, and God's favor, amen. We are victorious in Christ Jesus, amen. Thank you, Lord. Let's continue on reading God's word now in the book of Hallelujah. We will continue on reading that's right in the book of Isaiah chapter uh, 45. Father God, as we read your word, help us to understand, Lord. Give us, Father, the spirit of wisdom and revelation. In the knowledge of you, O oh Father, as we continue to read your word. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Come, let's carry on reading. Oh, it says so that. Thank you, Lord. Cyrus, the Lord's chosen one. This is what the Lord says to Cyrus, his anointed one, whose right hand we will empower before him. Mighty kings will be paralyzed with fear. Their fortress gates will be opened, never to shut again. This is what the Lord says. I will go before you, Cyrus, and level the mountains. I will smash down gates of bronze and cut through bars of iron. I will give you treasures hidden in darkness, secret riches. I will do this so you may know that I am the Lord, the God of Israel, the one who calls you my name. And why have I called you for this work? Why did I call you by my name, by, by name when you did not know me? It is for the sake of Jacob, my servant, Israel, my chosen one. I am the Lord. There is no other God. I have equipped you for battle, though you don't ever know me. So all the world from east to west will know that uh, will know there is no other God. I am the Lord, and there is no other. I created the light and make the darkness. I send good times and bad times. I, the Lord, am the one who does these things. Open up, O heavens, and pour out your righteousness. Let the earth open wide, so salvation and righteousness come sprout up together. I, the Lord, 
separated them. That so what sorrow awaits those who argue with the greater? Does a clay put put does a clay pot argue with its maker? Um, does the clay dispute with the one who ships it, saying, "Stop! You're doing it wrong." Does the pot exclaim, "How clumsy can you be? How terrible it would be if a newborn baby said to its father, 'Why was I born?'" Or if it say to its mother, why did you make me this way? So this is what the Lord says. The Holy One of Israel and your Creator, do, um, do you question what I do for my children? Do you give me orders about the work of my hands? I am the one who made the earth and created people to live in it. And my hands stretch out the heavens all the stars are at my command. I will raise up Cyrus to fulfill my righteous purpose, and I will guide his actions. Um, he will restore my city and free my captive people. Without seeking a reward, I, the Lord of heaven's armies, have spoken. Future Conversation of Gentiles this is what the Lord says. You will rule the Egyptians and Ethiopians and the Sabines. They will, be, they will come to you with all their merchandise and it will all be yours. They will follow you as, a, as prisoners in chains. They will fall to their knees in front of you and say, God is with you and he is the only God. There is no other. Truly, O God of Israel, our Savior, your work is mysterious ways. Amen. Thank you, Lord. All craftsmen who make idols will be humiliated. They will all be disgraced together. But the Lord will save the people of Israel with eternal salvation. Throughout everlasting ages, they will never again be humiliated and disgraced. For the Lord is God, and He created the heavens and the earth, and put everything in place. He made the world to be, to be lived in, not to be a place of empty chaos. I am the Lord, He says, and there is no other. I publicly proclaim bold promises. I do not wish fair obscur obscurities in some dark corner. I would not have told the people of Israel. Would not have, um, would not have told the people of Israel to seek me if I could not be found. I, the Lord, speak only what is true and declare only what is right. Indeed, Amen. Thank you, Father. And gather together and come, you fugitives from surrounding nations. What souls? Sorry about that. The wind is blowing. <laughs> All right, let's carry on. What fools they are who carry around their wooden idols and pray to gods that cannot save. Consult together, argue your case. To get together and decide what to say. Who made these things known so long ago? What idol are ever told you they would happen? What is not what is not I the Lord? For there is no other but as a God but me, indeed, hallelujah, a righteous God and Savior, there is none but me. Let all the world look for me for salvation, for I am God, there is no other. I have sworn by my name, I have spoken the truth, and I will never go back on my word. Every knee will bend to me, and every tongue will confess allegiance to me. The people will declare, the Lord is the source of all my righteousness and strength, and all the... And all who were angry with him will come to him and be ashamed. In the Lord, all the generations of Israel will be justified. And in him, they will boast. We will read again tomorrow, chapter 46. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father, for your word. Oh, we praise the Lord and we glorify you, O oh God. You are worthy of glory and honor and praise, Father. I pray for them, Lord, who do not know you, Lord, to come to know you and receive you. As their Savior and Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father, for this time and opportunity for me to be able to read your word. My fellow God's beloved, if you have not known the Lord Jesus as your Savior and Lord, come receive him from praises from your heart because he is the true Savior. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Father. Oh, we praise the Lord and we 
glorify you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Come, mga mahal. Let's receive the Lord as your Savior and Lord, because there is no other God but Him who is the true Savior. Hallelujah. There is no other God but the Lord Jesus God Himself, a righteous God and Savior. Come, let's pray this. Lord Jesus, I need you. Thank you for dying on the cross for my sins. I open the door of my life and receive you as my Savior and Lord. Uh, uh, hallelujah. I repent of my sins. Thank you for the forgiveness of my sins and giving me eternal life. Make me the kind of person you want me to be. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. My fellow God's beloved, if you have breath of prayer, Jesus came into your life. Your sins were forgiven. You became a child of God. You receive eternal life. You began a great adventure in which, for which God created you. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. And there is hope in Him. Father God, thank you for everything that was written in the past. Was written to teach us so that through endurance and the encouragement of the scriptures, we might have hope. Romans chapter 15, verse 4. There is always hope. We just need to know where to find it and we can find it in the lord jesus christ amen amen and it says also that hallelujah praise be to the lord to god our savior who daily bears our burdens this is the day to smile whoever smiles often um often brightens the day the light and lightens the burdens in psalms this is in psalms chapter 68 verse 19 we have to praise the lord hallelujah our god our savior who daily bears our burdens amen <laughs> thank you lord and you will find and you'll find you will find when you smile your day will be brighter amen and all the all your burdens will seem so much lighter indeed thank you father god oh hallelujah we praise the lord amen amen and it is here also sad the word of inspiration prayer is this the world in tune a spirit voice a vocal joys was echo is heaven's bliss by henry Vauchan. <laughs> and it says also that God thank you July 15 of course biblical self-esteem uh, takes the spotlight of me and uh, puts it on Jesus yes biblical self-esteem takes the spotlight of me and puts in on Jesus because he is Jesus our all in all amen amen hallelujah Thank you, mga mahal, for reading God's love letter with me. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. And always remember, always, always do remember that Jesus loves you. Goodbye. God bless and take care. Let's read again tomorrow. Bye-bye. Have a wonderful day. Jesus loves you so very much. Amen. Amen.